what is up people of youtube my name is arturo or you can call me churro and today guys i am back with another video today guys i am bringing you the fan takeover line from amazon the adam cole review so yeah this is pretty cool guys um the new fan takeover line from amazon is out and it's been up for a while and i think series 2 is about to come out which i'm hyped about but yeah pretty weird about this set i think we were supposed to get it i think it was supposed to be a walmart exclusive and now they made it an Amazon exclusive, which is pretty cool. And But I was kind of scared because, like, I thought I wouldn't be able to find the set. And um, luckily, I got a notification from Amazon. I got an email. They say that they restocked. And I was able to pick up the Adam Cole from the set, which is pretty cool. The um, So this is the packaging. Pretty, I really like the packaging. I like the blue and everything. I just like how it, the blue with the yellow, it really goes together. Nice contrast. And I really like the packaging. Then we have over here a picture of Adam Cole, another picture of Adam Cole right here. Um, this says that it's from NXT Takeover New York. Oh wait, no, this is a oh that's pretty cool. Oh okay okay, it says voted by the fans for the fans on WWE.com, and then it shows all the attires that they could have given they could have gave Adam Cole. Um, NXT Takeover New York where he faced Johnny Gargano, um, NXT Takeover War Games 2018, and then um, NXT. March 20, 2019. Um, the attire from this is, what's it called? The attire is from where, I think it was a five-man, what's it called? Championship, or a five-man number one contenders match. It was Adam Cole, Ricochet, Aleister Black, Matt Riddle, and I'm trying, I think there's one more person. It could have been a four-way, but I'm almost, I'm almost certain it was a five-way match. But yeah, winner would face Johnny Gargano, um, to become the what's it called the new NXT champion because at that time the NXT championship was vacant because Tommaso Ciampa um, got injured so he had to drop the belt so yeah, oh yeah there he goes look in a fatal five way to determine who would face Johnny Gargano for the NXT championship um, Adam Cole took his first step towards the era of undisputed gold so yeah that's the other person Velveteen Dream was in the was in the five way so pretty cool um, I don't know I don't know how WWE does their voting. Or if pe who are the people that are voting? Because I know when I what's it called when the polls first went live, everybody was mad because NXT or what's it called because everybody wanted the NXT Takeover War Games attire, which I wanted as well, so we could finally complete the NXT Takeover um, War Games Undisputed Era figures. Because we have Adam Cole, we I mean we have Bobby Fish, Roderick Strong, Kyle Riley, and we don't have an Adam Cole and. This is just a weird, like, kind of weird attire that they that they chose. I don't know. I wish we would have gotten, what's it called? The NXT TakeOver 2018. I actually voted for NXT TakeOver 2018. So, yeah. But pretty cool. Um, there's everybody else in the set. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, um, Shayna Baszler, Seth Rollins, Adam Cole. The only other person I might pick up from the set is Adam Cole. I mean, is Seth Rollins. I'm not sure about Ricky or Shayna. I'm not sure. And then another picture of Adam Cole. So yeah, pretty cool. We're going to open this guy up and we're going to get straight into the review, guys. All right, guys, here we have it. Adam Cole from the TakeOver line. This is pretty cool, guys. Um, it's called, the figure is like just an honestly solid figure. Like there's no, no real complaints about it. Um, I have complaints, but it's about, about the figure in general. Like what's called about almost all the Adam Cole figures, how they give him like these small legs, like kind of like Daniel Bryan legs. But other than that, pretty dope. Um, I wish they would got they would have gave him a new head scan. I think we need we need a new one already. This one's just not the best. Um, but let's talk about the accessories. Um, he comes of course with the shirt. It says Gold Bay Bay Gold. It's pretty cool. Um, no undisputed era logo on the back anymore. Um, yeah, he, he comes with the undisputed era armband as you can see right here, and then he comes with the NXT championship this one's a little bit different i the only other nxt championship that i have i have the original one and then i have the what's called um the the one that the first ever one that came with bobby Roode. um and this the only difference that i can tell is that the x on the bobby Roode has like it's more of like a silver silver tint and this one's just all gold so yeah i don't know which one's more accurate or not i think this one might be a little bit more accurate but i like the bobby Roode one and then um, he comes with an extra pair of hands, like the, just the mic holding hands, and then he comes with the Undisputed Era, like, logo hands, but I didn't take them out of the packaging because, um, they're kind of difficult to take out, and I just didn't want to mess with it. This one over here to the left was kind of difficult to take out. Then he also comes with the Adam Cole Bebe hands, like, 
what he does um a little bit warped mine's like a little bit bent which sucks um but let's take off the what's it called um the shirt and let's get more into it, the figure all right guys here we have the adam cole without it um i was wrong the shirt actually does have the undisputed era logo um pretty dope uh, let's see i don't want to put it back on but yeah it does have the undisputed era logo on the back um so here we have the figure without any accessories on it let's get into the head scan the head scan is a um re-release of elite 71 all of the head scans that adam cole has come out with or any figure any adam cole figure that have been re-releases um the undisputed era three pack head scan was re-released on his most recent basic and then this head scan is a re-release of the elite 71 um, this is the first ever Adam Cole figure with white wrist tape. And then um, this is his attire that he comes with, like I said, from that match for the Fatal 5 wave. Pretty cool. And the Speed of Air logo, AC logo for Adam Cole. Um, he has like yellow and then white and black and red, what's it called? Like lines going through the attire. It's pretty cool. On the back, it has like a yellow and yellow, white, and red theme or theme bay bay and yellow and then a white and then with the red outline um pretty cool undisputed era logo um undisputed era logo on the boots but guys one thing that already pissed me off is if you can tell already this has the loose torso i saw some people on instagram complain about it how they got the loose torso and this is one of the first ever figures that i've had that's come like this like i've never had a figure that's been this bad um and, and you tell or this bad as like loose i've never had a figure like this so yeah there's a first time for fucking everything but yep that sucks but i'm just gonna do this little method i i found out is that if you put mod podge like right here and like right there and then you you leave it back in its original spot then it what's called it tightens it up so it's not loose anymore because honestly i don't think there's any other way to fix that issue on the figures that i know of at least so yeah that sucks but yeah pretty dope figure guys um i would recommend you guys go get this figure if you guys need an adam cole uh, i'm gonna do some fix-ups to it just like yeah that's gonna be everything guys um honestly i think this is one of the weakest adam cole figures that we've gotten it just looks not as great right now but once i do some fix-ups to it it'll, it should look a little bit better um if i had to get this if i had to give this figure an overall rating i think it's six to six through seven out of ten just because it's really not nothing too special i wish we had got a better attire um with a different head scan or even the other head scan because this isn't the best adam cool head scan um and i don't know about different accessories i don't mind it but yeah that's everything guys um like i said i give this a six out of seven for sure or six maybe seven out of ten as a rating um, not the best figure. I don't think it's anything too special, but I would still recommend you guys go get it because I feel like once you do some fix-ups with it, it's going to look fantastic. All right, guys, here is actually the Adam Cole finish. I actually was going to wait for the, for another episode of Customizing with Churro, but I just thought to put it right here because the video is kind of short. So I just wanted to show you guys, the, um, the figure fixed up. And I think honestly, it looks absolutely amazing. First off, first thing we did, of course, is that we changed the head scope. That head scope is just that this head scope is 10 times better than that head scope. So I was like, let's switch it. And it looks fantastic. It is kind of low, but it is honestly not too bad. And it's really, it makes the figure look 10 times better. And then the other big change that we did was that we swapped the, the whole legs. So we swapped the legs. These are Cody Rhodes legs and we swapped the knee pads. And then we added the Undisputed Era boots from the Adam Cole. And it just looks absolutely fantastic, guys. Literally, that's the only thing we did. Two changes, head, head swap and uh, what's called leg swap. And it looks 10 times better than how the figure looked like before. And I highly recommend you guys do this fix up. Literally, all it is is that you need um the most recent adam cole head scan or if you have the undisputed era three pack head scan and then some cody rhodes legs like literally that's all you need guys and this figure looks absolutely insane it looks great with the with the new body parts and stuff like that it looks great and this this attire looks insane um with the white wrist tape and everything like that see if we got adam cole figures like this it would look absolutely fantastic and but luckily i uh, we can able we're able to do it ourselves and all you need is the part to do it and look at that it looks absolutely insane so yeah i highly recommend you guys do this fix up literally only took me like 10 minutes to heat up the head scans and the legs and literally just swap that's literally it guys 
so yeah just want to show you guys how it is so like i said thank you guys again for watching hope you guys like this video if you did please leave a like subscribe so you guys won't miss any of the next uh any of the future content and also comment down below to get shout out or to get chance to get a chance to get shout out in the next video so yeah let's get into the shout out of today all right guys before i end off today's video i just want to give out the shout out of today the shout out of today goes to master tune 64 he's actually a pretty good friend of mine a really good friend of mine and what's it called um and he commented down below he's like hey finally my favorite wrestler darby allen pretty cool i um, glad that you enjoyed the video bro go check out his channel really cool he um what's it called he he makes a bunch of videos over gaming um anime and collectibles and stuff like that so i highly recommend you guys check him out so yeah that was going to be um all of today like i said guys if you want to get a chance to get shouted out in the next video, all you have to do is comment down below. Like I said, all he did was really comment down, and look, he got a chance what's called, or he got shouted out in the video. So yeah, so go shout out or leave a comment in today's video to get a chance to get shout out in the next video. So leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.